What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Wolfcryer here, and welcome to Wolfcryer IRL, where I get to talk about whatever the hell I want. And ladies and gentlemen, it has been a little while. It's been two weeks since I put up one of these videos, so I'm glad to be back at it. So what we're going to do in this video is pretty much just BS and talk about what's been going on as of late with the channel, with the stream, with everything with me. And uh, overall, it's been pretty awesome. A few negative things in the beginning. I did apply for Twitch partnership once again, and once again, I was denied partnership. Now, partnership doesn't guarantee me more money or anything like that, but I really would like to get partnered on Twitch, seeing as I've been doing this for over two years. Hopefully, hopefully I've been a benefit to the community and... It's been really cool streaming regardless of whether or not I get partnered at any time in the future. I will still continue to stream and that sort of thing. So I'm still going to be doing it, but it would be nice to get the recognition of being partnered on Twitch. But tis what it is, ladies and gentlemen. And on the YouTube front, let's see, a couple of negative things there as well. First up, Mr. CJDJ123 still has all 91 of my videos up on his channel and that is mind-boggling because I've not only reported his channel but I've reported the videos individually to YouTube and not a peep from YouTube no email no response no takedowns of these videos nothing so I guess that's a lost cause maybe perhaps we'll have to wait and see on that and on the demonetization bullshit that YouTube's been going through, every single one of my videos that I put up on the YouTube nowadays, I have to go and re-monetize about 24 hours after I put the video up. Pretty much a pain in the ass, but guess that is what it is as well. I guess that's just going to be part of my video making process because... I still enjoy making videos for YouTube, that sort of thing. I have also been uploading my videos to Twitch as of late too, hoping maybe that's going to help out with the partnership and to give my Twitch viewers the same access to those videos as well. But I love making YouTube videos. I love making, you know, the creative aspect of making the video, filming it, and then editing it. I enjoy all that type of stuff. I also enjoy making thumbnails, stuff like that. With the stream, I enjoy making overlays and all that behind the scenes type of stuff. I love the artistic aspect or the creative aspect to this. And it's pretty cool. On a side note on that demonetization thing and that guy with the videos of mine on his channel, hopefully... And I'll know soon on this, hopefully, maybe joining a multi-channel network is the way to go there. Maybe they can help me out with that sort of thing. And thankfully, Riker, who is absolutely an amazing person, has hooked me up with his rep for a MCN. I want to see what they can offer to the YouTube channel, that sort of thing. Maybe take some of that stuff off my shoulders so that I can actually focus on streaming, making videos, and that sort of thing, and not have to deal with all the extra BS that goes with it. So, we'll have to wait and see. Thank you once again, Riker, for that. Guys, that's what's awesome about this Diablo 3 community. I pretty much have a working relationship with plenty of the most amazing Diablo 3 streamers and YouTubers, period. I mean, I talked to Dropadooski, Riker, Bloodshed, Leviathan, SVR90, Zanji, Adam A. Disco Bear, Big Daddy Den, and all these guys. If you don't know any of them, please go check out their Twitch page and their YouTube channels because they are all very amazing people and a great part of this Diablo 3 community. And that is just pretty epic that I'm involved in that type of stuff, talking to those guys. I mean, those guys, some of those guys are legends. And it's very cool to be able to have conversations with them, ask them questions, pick their brains on certain things, that sort of thing. And that's been pretty awesome. I just love the Diablo 3 community from the streamers onto the viewers and, you know, followers, that sort of thing. My followers on YouTube. My subscribers here, my followers and subs over on Twitch, my patrons, you guys are all freaking awesome. 
just awesome. And we are closing in on 14,000 YouTube subscribers. That's pretty epic. Can't wait to reach 15,000. Hopefully I can get there, but let's focus on 14K first, ladies and gentlemen. If you're not subscribed yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. It definitely helps me out. And if you want to help out the stream, check out my Patreon page. Check out the Twitch page. You know, pop a sub over there. Drop some bits, that sort of thing. But guys, just hanging out in my stream and watching these videos, that's help enough for me. If you guys want to, you know, help out further than that, definitely appreciate it. But just you guys chilling with me, hanging out with me and watching my videos is just, it's just epic. I'm loving this. I'm loving the whole ride. It's been over two years and it's still pretty crazy, you know. It's been over two years doing Twitch, probably around a year and eight months doing Diablo 3 content for YouTube, and it's just been, it's just been epic, and I'm still enjoying it so very, very much. Guys, another thing, I was on an episode of the West March Workshop. I will link that down below. Leviathan. Leviathan is another guy who I forgot to mention when talking about those Diablo 3 content creators that, that I get to talk to and pick their brains and stuff. Leviathan is pretty awesome and he hooked me up with getting on to Westmarsh Workshop and me and Ninebeard, we had a conversation for about two hours. I'll link the video down below so you can go check that out. We talked about a lot of stuff charity and gaming such as level with a cause a charity event that i set up for opening season for diablo 3 every season gonna start working on the next one soon ladies and gentlemen but we also talked about diablo 3 in general we talked about botting band waves that sort of stuff we talked about the future of diablo 3 so if you want to see a pretty cool conversation between me and nine beard feel free to go check that out he's an awesome dude and Definitely was a cool experience being on the West March workshop. That was pretty epic. Ladies and gentlemen, the stream's been going awesome. I get some massive hosts from the best of the best in Diablo 3, and I love you all so very much. Love you guys for checking out the stream, for watching these videos. It's been crazy. With the holidays coming up, I will be looking at the stream schedule because... Currently, I'm probably killing myself with this five hours of sleep crap every single night. But for now, I'll keep that schedule and add days if I am off the next day, like tonight. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. If you want to stop on by the stream, feel free to do so. But overall, I got to take a look at it because I'm kind of starting to burn myself out with the streaming. And I want to make sure that I'm still doing YouTube, but I love streaming as well but i don't want to overwhelm myself with five hours of sleep trying to work a 10-hour day coming home taking care of the kids getting ready for stream doing it all over again and so i gotta find some balance in that especially with you know leaving myself enough room in my schedule to make videos sometimes i have to hurry up and make a video so that i can get to streaming in a couple hours overall still loving it i just need to find a way to tone myself back a little bit just to make sure i'm getting enough sleep make sure i'm keeping that energy up for the videos for the streams so that you guys come and i'm not just uh, and playing video games and stuff so i love communicating with the stream chit chatting with you folks and overall i'm still loving it but yeah we're gonna tone it back a little bit maybe I liked it before, but it wasn't a set schedule. And what I would do was stream on nights when I didn't have to work at, you know, get up at 4.30 in the morning the next day. And that was a little bit easier. But the problem with that is the days rotated. But overall, guys and gals, thank you so very much for taking the time out of your day to watch this video. I greatly greatly appreciate it and all the support on the stream on patreon on youtube you guys are just absolutely amazing and i love you all for those of you not subscribed go ahead click that subscribe button hit that like button guys thank you once again and you guys have a great day peace